Kilauea continues to erupt at its summit within Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. Although the nearly five-month-long eruption has been characterized by an on-and-off pattern of lava effusion, in recent weeks the volcano has been active more often than not. The vigor of the eruption has also appeared to increase in recent days with numerous and sustained ooze-outs along the margins and interior seams of the crater floor. The area of active lava is visible to National Park visitors, and it has been putting on a show. With a molten lake feeding a cascading falls into a swirling circle, where the lava appears to be swallowed back down by the volcano. This video recorded above the summit by Tropical Visions video shows the eruption as it appeared on March 24th. Scientists say that since the beginning of this event back on September 29th of last year, the crater floor has seen a total rise of about 89 meters or 292 feet. The volume of lava effused in that time is calculated to be about 58 million cubic meters or 76 million cubic yards. The appearance of the eruption is constantly evolving. But this map, produced by the U.S. Geological Survey this month, provides a good general reference. The entire pink area shows the full extent of the lava flows, although most of it is presently crusted over. The main eruptive vent is shown here in orange. Lava from this vent ends up in an intermittent lava lake colored red on this map. The lake falls into a circular hole on the southeast end of the lake. A smaller, persistent lava pond is shown here in purple. This pond is active even during eruptive pauses. These yellow shapes are the islands that formed when the summit erupted in December 2020. The alert level for Kilauea remains at watch, with all recent activity confined to the summit crater. There are no indications of activity migrating elsewhere on the volcano.